Hundreds of South Florida residents looking for some sort of assistance during the COVID-19 pandemic waited for free food in Pembroke Pines, Florida. As you can see, people have been lined up since 6 a.m. So we opened up the lines earlier and with our great staff and all the volunteers, we're helping the residents of our great city, Pembroke Pines. Feeding South Florida has assisted in helping thousands of families during this pandemic. Well, ever since the, the start of the COVID-19 crisis, we've been reaching out to cities across our four county service area. This, of course, is in Barrow County, so we reached out to the city of um, Pembroke Pines to see if we could organize a municipal type distribution in partnership with the city and feeding South Florida. Organizing an event like this takes a very special skill set, one that comes secondhand to the employees from the city of Pembroke Pines. A lot of logistics, but in recreation, we do events all the time. So it was um, something that we were able to step up to the challenge and do. People are needy right now because of this terrible virus, the terrible pandemic, and we are gonna help them with all their needs. That's what the city of Pembroke Pines does. These are such unprecedented times. People don't have any concept of what all this is all about and how it has impacted their families. Everything about their daily life has been impacted. So we're here today to try to do what we can do to help our folks. Here we go. Employees came from all over the city to help out. And my team was itching to get out. Most of my employees have been working from home. They were very happy to come out here and lend a hand and help feed the community. This is a city that helps its people. Have a good one, be safe. And we help each other and we spread kindness. We have kindness day, we have so many activities for families, and this is what we do. This is, this is what Pembroke Pines is all about. We are on uncharted waters right now, and the way we are coming together and making things happen for our families is amazing, so thank you. Not only city officials, but county officials showed up ready to help. I want to come out and help our community, so if by passing out food and putting chicken in cars is going to make somebody's life better, I'm here to do it. And I can't thank the city of Pembroke Pines and Feeding South Florida enough for doing this for our residents. People were thrilled with the assistance. Especially the days that we're living in, with so much need, so much unemployment, you know. It's very important. Coming together during these unforeseen events is one of the best ways to deal with a crisis. Well, if you just take a look around at, at the way that everybody is coming together, all the industries, all the communities, uh, you know, to, to help people in need, I mean, it just shows uh, the human compassion that we have, that when we are faced with adversity, we definitely know how to come together and we definitely know how to help each other. The food distribution was a huge success and nearly 1,000 cars were given free food. We are stronger than this virus in Pembroke Pines. Together, we will beat this.